Hey there, welcome back to Sports Lessons Applied to Business. I'm Joe Harmon, founder, Good Karma Registration. Today's lesson comes from Tim Duncan, and it is Play the Right Way. I enjoyed watching Tim's career. I'm sure you did too. It was nice to see a good, humble superstar having a great career. It, it was like a pleasure watching him play the game because he played the right way. Yes, maybe a little old school with all his pick and rolls, and I think he whined a little too much about not getting calls. But in terms of playing the game, he played the right way. I don't think Tim ever missed a dunk trying to show off. As a coach, many of us will have team rules, so this is another way to think about playing the right way. Um, some coaches will have a lot of rules. Don't do this, don't do this, don't do this, don't do this. They'll have a full page of things not to do. Near the end of my career, I started having one team rule. Do the right thing. And we really talked about that rule when we were going on road trips with the young people. Do the right thing. And I think we got better performance um, out of the players by having that rule. Because people instinctively know the right thing to do. So now let's think about business. Play the right way. Do business the right way. As a counterexample, let's look at Exxon. Exxon's in the news now. Um, so Exxon pays millions and millions of dollars to uh, climate denier organizations because they want that message out there rather than what, you know, 99.7% of the scientific community says, which is climate change is real. Exxon makes more money when there's not all these restrictions on pollutants going into the air, right? So they're not doing business the right way. There are ways that we might be able to clean up our act in 2017 as well. Um, don't lie to your customers in order to get business. Don't use car salesman-like techniques uh, to trick people into buying your business. So let's all do a little self-analysis. I, I know I have some ways that I need to clean up my act in 2017 and do business the right way. And maybe there's a couple of things that, um, that you and your staff could work on as well. So thank you for watching um, another installment of Sports Lessons Applied to Business. You can see the whole series on our blog at goodkarmaregistration.com. And if your company or organization runs events, maybe basketball camps or tournaments or leagues, any sport, any business event, our company provides online registration platforms. They're free and we build them for you. So give me a call if you want to talk about that. Hey, thanks a lot. Have a great 2017. See you tomorrow.